Want to know a surprising way to soothe a toothache? We've all suffered from them. Well, an option is, believe it or not, clove oil. Mm. So what some people will do is they'll take a, pi a piece of clean tissue or cotton, and as you watch Dr. Batra, if you dip it into the clove oil so it soaks up just a few drops, then gently wipe the oil over your gums where you're feeling some of the pain. And if that clove oil is too strong, you can actually dilute it with some olive oil. What mm. clove oil contains is something known as eugenol. That is a natural anesthetic as well as an antibacterial. It can help to work to reduce inflammation in your mouth. According to the British Association of Oral and Maxillofacial Surgeons, researchers found that patients who had a tooth extracted and used a eugenol-based paste suffered the least amount of pain and after effects. It's kind of another nice. food is medicine sort natural of. Natural I mean. remedy, yeah. And they you can did buy it. this anywhere like a health food store or? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I, they I, did a comparison. It actually worked as well as benzocaine in one study, which I was wow. kind of surprised I wonder how by. many dentists are incorporating this yeah. after a wisdom tooth I mean, extraction. Or yeah, you, would, you, don't wanna, you don't want to overdo it on yeah, the clove oil because it's, it's, it's strong. Yeah, yeah, you can it's smell strong. it all the way it's on this strong. side of the desk. But hopefully you guys saw it's just a drop or two right on a swab and then right on the gum where it hurts. It's got an anesthetic property to it. And hey, the best thing to do, though, think, is practice good oral hygiene I think and reduce works those toothaches. Too. What, what, Drew? <laughs> I think whiskey works too. <laughs> Touche. Antibacterial as well. And for more of Dr. Orton's well. wonderful health tips, go to thedoctorstv.com.